Sorry, I'm shaky. I have terrible anxiety. My name's Kiki. I'm just removing one of my regular calluses. I already did the other toe and didn't think to record it till now, of course. This is my first video. Hopefully it's well received. Not too many haters. <laughs> Is that what they're called these days? I don't know. I'm probably dating myself right now. Shh. Quiet, Kiki. <laughs> way too deep. Trim up the edge, see where I'm at. Now I'm still figuring out all the best ways to do stuff and the best tools to use so they're gonna change probably a lot until I find my favorites these are just some basics that I picked up at my local Walmart That'll help us establish a perimeter without going too deep. Sorry, guys. Now this tool I also just picked up at my local Walmart. It actually came with the toenail nippers I got. It has the basic, you know, serrated edge where you can file the nail and I'm assuming you can use that as a cuticle pusher. Uh, but it's this side that I really was interested in. One side is rounded while the other side is flat and it's just my new favorite tool it 
it's not too sharp. Here's a problem area where it was getting too deep. Snip that, start working it. So it's more superficial. Oops, sorry guys, I'm still <laughs> learning. I gotta remember my angles and views so that you guys can see. Some spots here are gonna be a little sensitive afterwards where they're pretty deep, but I'm trying not to have too many areas like that. That's like my main goal in my brain that causes a defense response from your skin and causes it to just callous up and even worse. That's not what we want. Okay. So, let's see if I can change the angle here. real deep right in this area here and I want to be careful bring that back up a little bit guy back because I think I stopped that overly deep situation Just slowly work the dead skin away from the healthier levels of skin. Just keeping an eye on different layer levels and making sure everything melts together smoothly. And for me, smoothly means that I 
might get it removed without injuring myself, <laughs> causing any bleeding, poking, tearing. Better not quite enough than too much. Now I'm not sure what causes my skin to do this, but I will throw out there that I have psoriasis genetically from my father, who got it from his father, and the level of severity has gone up and down my entire life, but it is definitely at a very low level of severity right now. It's very under control. I'm a little sensitive right here, means it's a little too deep. Let's give that a little nip. I'm on the West Coast. I don't know about all y'all, or a few, but all y'all few <laughs> that might watch this, but I am from the West Coast. So if you have recommendations for tools and where to get them, throw me some comments, you guys. I am open. I'm also looking for comments and suggestions on uh, videoing. I'm very new at this. Is there certain stands people like to use or pods or whatever? Do you use your phone? What's your go-to recording device for your social media videos?
without giving all of your secrets away. <laughs> Just slowing down because it's getting a little more tender in this spot down here. I'm gonna move over to this side. I'm a lefty, but I just switched over to my right hand. Look at that, my first show of red. Not so bad, if I don't say so myself, for uh, how much I've gotten done. You can't really tell, but right there, got a little nip. We're getting there. Let's see if you can see it now, right there, yeah, right there, there's a good sensitive spot. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. That's why we go careful and slow, because that could have be worse than it is already. doing real good. This dead skin is just willing to push right away. Push to be pushed off of the healthy skin as long as it's not too shallow. Shallow? No. As long as it's not too deep. I 
once I start making more videos and picking up more lingo and getting tips and tricks and stuff, then I'll start, I'll stop being so anxious and jumbling my words and being a total goober. I mentioned my name was Kiki, but just for those of you who care to ask, I use she, her pronouns. And please feel free to let me know if you reach out to me, what pronouns you would prefer to use if they are different than what someone would naturally label you with. Almost there. It's just real deeply connected in the center. No, I don't need all the judgmental comments. I know this is a crap video and the angle's terrible and all the things, but you know, be patient with me. It's going to be my very first post and I can only go up from here, right guys? We're ready for the disconnection, ladies and gentlemen. It's just being held together by different layers in the same spot. Hmm. I poked myself. My dogs are about to bark because neighbors are talking outside. But maybe not. And I'm about to get it off. Ready, guys? Ready, ready, ready? Oh, come on. Come on, beautiful. 
I'm going to nip it. There it is. Holy cow, you guys. Not too shabby. We got some Burt's Bees cream over here. Put some of that on there. Of course, there's different levels of skin still remaining and different depths but there you guys have it thanks for watching